just getting back home from a Bape pop-up because Atlanta does not have a Bape store and I think they're trying to like revive Bape because you know the whole hype beast thing is like going supreme Bape like people don't really or at least I didn't think they wore it anymore but I think they're trying to revive it and so they just did a Bape pop-up in Buckhead and they invited me so I went to that and now I'm back home and I got some food I got a cheesesteak from uh cheesesteak from Woody's a strawberry shortcake from Publix, not Publix, not Publix, Whole Foods. And I got some snacks for the plane. Uh, I have to pack for my New York City trip. Me and my friend are going to New York for a couple days. I just felt like going. Uh -huh. That's good. Do you ever just feel like packing up and just going somewhere? You know, and I'm not a New York City fan at all. If y'all know me, y'all know I'm not a New York City fan. But there are just things that you can't get anywhere else that you can get in New York City, like Broadway. I've never been to a Broadway show. And I was like, I want to go to New York and go, go to a Broadway show. I want to get a reservation at Carbone's, even though I wasn't able to get that reservation because it was so last minute. But yeah, I was like, let's just go to New York. So me and Erica, we're going to go to New York for just the weekend. The flight is super early. Like it's like 6 a.m., so we can have like the full weekend experience, you know. And right now it's like 10 p.m. As always, I have not packed. Suitcase is right there. I have not packed y'all, so. But I just had to eat. I haven't really eaten all day. So I was like, okay. After that event, I was like, let me just come back. Pick up some food. And then I'll pack in peace and pack for this trip. I have not had this strawberry shortcake parfait from Whole Foods yet. This thing is $4. Ooh, strawberry shortcake parfait, yes. Bon appetit. I mean, of course, delectable. I mean, we're talking about Whole Foods here. Whole Foods Bakery is top tier. And it's strawberry shortcake. You can't really mess that up. If you mess up strawberry shortcake, something is very much, it's your, the IQ is, is, is declining. I just be needing something sweet, y'all. Like, at the end of a long day, I need a cold cigarette to ease the pain. <laughs> okay, let me show you guys the key pieces that I'm bringing to New York. Um, and what I'm like, you know, what the, what the vibe is that I'm going for. I'm definitely bringing this jacket because, I mean, this needs no explanation. I got this from Forever 21. Um, I think like the beginning of this year, I've worn it maybe twice. There's not many opportunities to wear something like this in Atlanta. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know. This just gives New York. So this is definitely coming. Then I just got this jacket from Zara. It is like, I mean, look at it. I don't need to tell y'all how cute this is. It's, it's so cute. It's like a big kind of oversized leather jacket. I definitely want to bring this too. So that's another key piece. Another key piece is this Zara blazer. It's a fitted blazer. I just got this maybe, I think I got it last week. But it's fitted. It's amazing. I figured I, this could be a top, you know, and I don't need anything under it. With a nice pair of pants, and that would be that. And my key shoes that I need to bring are these Stuart Weitzman heels. I've only worn these, I think, maybe two times. No, I think I only wore them once. And I'm like, every opportunity that I can wear these shoes, I need to wear these shoes. They're adorable. And also these Versace heels. Love them, love them, love them. Got them on the website on sale for like three something. And I think they were originally like uh, seven something, I think, or like around eight. Got them on sale for like 300 bucks. Amazing. I don't even know the bags that I'm going to bring. I mean, I can really only bring maybe one bag and i hate squishing bags into luggage i hate it hate it hate it i just feel like i just have this anxiety like oh my gosh the bags they're getting squished so i think my fendi fendigraphy let me tell you guys why i chose these outfits and what we're gonna do i wanted to go to new york honestly this is like a content trip you guys i was just like i want to make some content we're gonna go see a broadway show we're gonna go see hamilton we're gonna go, um, I really wanna get some ballet tickets. I haven't chose the ballet yet, but I really wanna get ballet tickets. So those are gonna be like the main two kind of like things at night to get nice and dressed up for, cutesy, chic. So that's why you saw what you saw. 
we are also going to have lunch at Tiffany's. I mean, that's, we're going to have lunch at Tiffany's. Yes, adorable. We're going to go to the Met Saturday morning. Um, but yeah, that's like the gist of it. So I just feel, I want to get like just really nice, cute content, just really cutesy, get a lot of photos, a lot of videos and just have fun because every time i go to new york i just don't have fun y'all but i'm just trying to have a, like a really upscale um experience this time and I, i'm sure i will because one thing about my friend erica y'all think that i'm bougie or you know erica is that times 10 okay they, they call her e-class they call her E-class. She was like, don't call me E-class for nothing. She's she's the classy friend. So with Erica, it has to be upscale. So it's going to be a very cute time. But all right, y'all. Good night. It's like 10 p.m. I'm about to get in the bed after I pack this stuff. And because I got, I need to get at least five hours of sleep. If I get five hours of solid sleep, I honestly think I'll be okay. So I need to like do this right now. All right. Have a good night, you guys, and I'll see you in the morning. Bye. The fact that every time I get a new piece of clothing, especially when it's black, this little girl has to put her little paws on my new stuff. Get your paws off my stuff. Y'all, I'm just now landing in New York. I missed my first flight because Clear was a horror show i don't even they want me to renew i'm not renewing clear there's no reason it was horrible so i missed my first flight i was so mad but spirit had another flight flying out like super like quickly after so i hopped on that flight and now i'm finally here oh my gosh y'all don't even know how mad i was i was cursing mad i gotta ask god to forgive me y'all but we finally made it so I'll catch up when we get to the hotel. We're at Joe's Pizza. Pizza looks good. I have to put bread, the flakes, and like palm on every single time. Yes. No matter what kind of pizza it is, that's always so good. Oh, okay. There's a water stain. Yeah. <laughs> okay, the sex is really cute. These are cute. I always tend to go for Gucci brand sunglasses. They always look good on me. These are cute. And of course, I like the most expensive ones. These are so cute. Can I try? Get the right one. I right. I'm not crazy about these ones. These were the ones I really wanted too, and I don't like them. Eight dollars a slice. Okay. It looks really good. It is really good. Focus. Oh yes. <laughs> this is busting, y'all. This is good. Busting. Magnolia is busting. I like the cheetah print. It's cute. Child, we finally got to our rooms after a long and hard day we have, we have like a empire state building view or so that's the empire state building what is this considered this considered midtown oh i know we're like literally super close to times square oh, when i get to a hotel i unpack all my clothes i don't see how people can just leave their stuff in the suitcase and then struggle with the suitcase for four or five days a week i unpack all my clothes i hang them up in the closet if we have drawers i put them in the drawers i take out all my shoes i take out everything because if i'm paying for a space i'm using the space that just makes sense so day one in new york started off rough missed my flight got on the next flight no problem whatever 
And then all this walking, girl. I'm not used to all this walking. Put me in a core. But we're gonna take a little nap. We're not napping, we're relaxing. That's what it is. And then I'm gonna get cute and ready and depuff my hair. It got puffy when I was sweating running through the airport. Never again, I'll never run through an airport again. If I miss the flight, I miss the flight. I ain't even make it, ran for nothing. Hamilton was really good. It was really good. I, I thought it was a tear jerker. Erica said it's not. No, but it was really good. Everyone yeah. Did. And Erica a cry baby, so I'm surprised. Oh. <laughs> They have some kind of parade going on. It's Korean. Hmm. I'm trying to get some coffee before we go to the museum. I came to Culture Coffee and I got a chai tea latte and a chocolate chip cookie because I think you're supposed to get a chocolate chip cookie when you come here. Supposedly they're really good, so we'll see. Now, I don't know how Egyptian people look now. I've never been to Egypt. All I'm saying is... That's all I'm saying. One thing about the Egyptians, they ain't play with their hair. Eyeliner and wigs on point. Okay. That's literally a do-rag. Look at that. They were wrapping their hair at night. Shopping in Zara, and I just see so much I want. That's so cute. If the Lord wasn't disciplining me with my money right now, first of all, I shouldn't even be on this trip. But if the Lord wasn't disciplining me with my money, I'd be shopping right now. But it's like I'm already out, and I've already spent so much money, I can't spend anymore. Seems like we're getting through security, and I'm. Um, if I miss this flight, I'm gonna really crash out. We made it through, y'all. By the grace of God. Because if I didn't make it to church and I bought an expensive flight just to make it to church and I don't make it, I would have cried. Like, I would have cried. So, <laughs> we gonna make it. So I get the more expensive early flight to be able to make it back home for church, only for there to be a fire at the Newark airport. All flights get delayed an hour. So the TSA lines were out of control for an hour. Then I had to wait an hour at the gates just for me to miss church. And that's the only reason I got this early flight. So I could have saved money, slept in for another three, four hours, and it would have been the same result. Honestly, y'all, I can't even complain anymore. Like, I'm so out of complaints. I'm just really over it. Bye.